Colin, I guess how do you guys get up back on track and do you feel that you guys are getting back on track with the current losing streak heading into Georgia? I mean, yeah, I mean, uh, we played a couple of hard teams and I know that's nothing to use a, as a, you know, of anything, so, but we got to just get back on track. We got to play like Mississippi State. Um, I think the biggest thing for us is just to uh, just go out there and know that we are able to win against SEC competition. That's the biggest thing for us is the confidence part. In the second half, are the struggles of all of that related just the day up? I mean, is it really that simple? Um, it, it can be, but you know we got a, we got a good enough team out there to to win ball games, and so we can't use that for anything. We just, we just got to go out there and play basketball. As a player, when you see uh, the Marcus Smart situation, what goes through your head? Having I mean, probably heard all kinds of stuff from fans. What was your reaction when you first initially saw it? Um, my reaction was, you know, he made, he made a mistake, um, but you know, it's him. He, he's got to live with the consequences. And you know, learn from your mistakes. My mom always told me, always gonna learn from your mistakes. And what, what you do, you always gotta have consequences of it. How much do you hear? I guess the noise from fans when you're on the court. Uh, you hear, you hear it sometimes, but you, you just want to play. You just want to go out there and play basketball. Then the biggest thing Coach Ray always says is, forget the fans. The fans, fans will always be there, but you have to worry about your teammates. So I think the one thing that we do as a team, we try to hear our teammates out. Have you had those? Situations on the road, either here, junior college, whenever, where people are yelling rough things oh, at you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm a white kid with a lot of tattoos. I hear it all the time, so, but I'm used to it. Um, I like it, kind of kind of encourages us. It gives us a little motor going, so, you know, it's just, I, I, like, I like when fans are out there and talkative and screaming and doing all the stuff that fans do. It's usually you, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> Colin, you say you hear it. When, when do you hear it during the game? Uh, mainly, mainly it's probably layup line beginnings, and then uh, sometimes that tip. But that, besides that, we out there playing basketball, we're out there playing Mississippi State basketball. We're not worried pretty much about the crowd, but we're worried about ourselves. When you're playing, do you? When you actually got it, do you I, even hear anything really? Uh, I try to avoid it. I mean, you can hear it sometimes when taking the ball out, but you try to avoid that. You try to just play basketball. After the Vanderbilt game, I asked you about the mood in the locker room. You that said everything was still kind of good. Uh, a week and a half later, how are things, you know, with the rest of your teammates? Uh, the mood is good. The mood is uh, we got to get better. And we keep on saying every time we're in a huddle, our last thing we said, we got to get better. Because at the end result of the game, we have to win the game. And we got to win more than one game. So I think the biggest thing for us, we just we just got to get better as a, as a team, not just with one person. We just got to work all together and make sure we all play together as one. Coach Ray said after the Texas A&M game, he wasn't happy with the effort and stuff. He was happy with the effort uh, Saturday, but still the same result. But you know, kind of, what do you have to do to kind of build off of that and, and you know, going into the Georgia game this week? Uh, I think the biggest thing for us was we gotta play like we're playing Kentucky every night, or we play we gotta, we gotta play like we're playing one of the best teams in the nation every night. I think that's the biggest thing for us. We 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 play down to our competition. No harp on you know. Texas A&M or any uh, any other team, but you know we gotta play to the level that we're playing against. So we gotta play up, or we gotta even match it.